Handega, Lava. I am a guide at John's Castle. So I start to be a guide as from 2003. We are at the main cave. Those are the figures. They show us how is the Bushmen look like. This display show us the typical Bushmen. They were not very tall. They were 1.5 meter tall. The man up there, he carried a bow and arrows. The woman, they were used the calabash when they want to fetch or to drink water, or they were also used the ostrich at shell. Here we have an example of the bush bank. These are the therianthropes, half human, half animal. The one, three heads, one, two, three. The woman passing the baby to the one carrying the baby on her back. Those are the goats. You see the face and the body. Those are the horses. You see by its neck. The Nokkiri on the past, the Guinea people, they were used as their weapons. But today, lots of people use it as the walking sticks. Initially, so the sand or the bushmen, they were hunt, eland, blast bog, the and other type of bugs, but later they will also have the domestic animal. The six people they were listening to the shaman or to the Sangoma, what their ancestors tell him so that they can be well informed about it. Those people look like other shaman made doing the trance dance, holding other people's hands. Uh, underneath there is uh, other paintings of the island. It's totally different. It's painted by different people. Three people dancing like the Zulu dance. Clap hands, lift leg up. Three hunters, the sea antelope they want to hunt. There we can see the example of a leopard. We see the long tail and the short legs. Behind it, it's a mountain red bump. It's crazy. This is the unique of the painting of the bubble. We didn't see the painting of the bubble a lot of them. They will also paint the unique painting of the crow or some other type of birds. 